It's time for Furry Friends on Good Day Virginia, sponsored by Barclays Pet Market, your pet's pit stop. That's right, we're talking furry friends this morning. This is when we get to highlight our local animal shelters offering adoptions. Today's furry friend comes to us from Franklin County Animal Shelter. And today we have Stephanie Wright with us and a beautiful little girl yes. as well. Who is this darling? This is Andrina that's looking for treats. <laughs> and she is um, a, just about a two year old uh, mix. We were just talking about what kind she might be. She probably has a little bit of everything in her. Yeah. Maybe some plot, mm -hmm. maybe some boxer, some pity. But she's just nothing but a baby doll. She is, I mean, look how gentle. Mm -hmm. I, so yeah. first of all, she's sitting and I say, oh, oh. oh do you want to do a paw? Did you want to yeah. do the paw? paw? She's, say I'm learning paw. the paw. You're learning, but look, she's really good at, when I say wait, mm -hmm. good girl. She doesn't go for no, it. No, no. <gasps> oh, you are so gentle. Yeah, <laughs> she, she is such a sweet soul. Um, <laughs> she has come such a long way since she first came into us. She was extremely scared. She would hide in the corner of her kennel um, and she has just blossomed now that she's become more comfortable with everyone. She is been my sidekick to every event we've had oh. and everyone loves her she just has not been adopted and we just don't understand so we thought we'd bring her on TV and and kind of get her out there yeah she's so sweet I've been trying to get her to get down but she's mm -hmm. always like I'm a lady yes Amanda. I'm a lady I don't get down <laughs> can you go down no she's like, you stay up yeah can you do a paw you just want the treat can I get a kiss She's like, uh-uh. She's like, I've got my head on I that know. treat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't get over how gentle and sweet she's been since the mm -hmm. moment she got in. Oh, yeah. And, and like you said, she's done so well with mm -hmm. like, so one thing I found so cool when you told me you brought her in, she's like your test dog with other dogs. Yes. Because she's that good. Mm -hmm. So she has turned into our dog tester. She's good with cats and everything too. So if we need to see if a cat is going to be okay with the dog, she's the one that we take in there oh. to the community room. <laughs> Kara. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, you know, any dogs that come in and we're like, okay, we're not quite sure, we will actually test them with her and let them go out in the play yard. We're obviously watching very closely, but she is just the, the best dog ever, honestly. Wow. Like, whoever ends up adopting her is truly getting an amazing dog. Uh -huh. And like you said, you think she's around two years mm -hmm. old. Aww. She does get a little playful at times. Mm -hmm. She'll, there she goes. There you go. <laughs> um, she will do little zoomies around, but for the most part, this is her. She's just kind of chill, laid back. Um, she rides great in a car. Oh, that's good. So, mm -hmm. I mean, you don't even know she's really back in the back seat. Aww. Oh, so, you're yeah. such a good girl. Yeah. So tell us, how are things going at the shelter right now? Um, we are, like every other shelter, we are busting at the seams. Um, we have most of our uh, dogs are actually sponsored so that means that you know you can get the dog for free because someone else has paid their adoption fee um, we do know that we're having um, quite an intake of small dogs coming in so mm -hmm. if you know you can't get a bigger dog and you want to give a home to a small dog we're telling everybody just keep an eye on our Facebook page mm -hmm. we're posting them as they come in um, but we're going to be doing lots of donation drives uh, lots of adoption events coming up soon because we really need to get these animals out. And yeah. with the holidays coming, I mean, you know, we're asking people, Black Friday, get a little case of food yeah. or something, bring it to yeah. the animals because we're just, we have so many in our care. I think we have right over a hundred right now. Oh, wow. um, and that's a lot for a small municipal shelter. Yeah, that so, is. Yeah. All right, so let's hopefully, Andrina, are we gonna find you a forever home? Because if no one takes you home, they're crazy. Yeah. I would take you, <laughs> I'm tempted. Yeah. Oh my gosh, so if folks are interested in adopting her or any mm -hmm. other animals you have at the shelter, well, where do they go, what do they, what do they do? Yeah, so you can give us a call, you can come to the shelter. We're at 81 State Street in Rocky Mount. Um, the best way to do is just to come in. Um, you know, you can message us on Facebook and everything, but we want to help you find the right dog or cat for you. So if you come in and let us know what you're looking for, we can show you one that maybe you wouldn't have thought about mm -hmm. and it might work best for you, but we do allow people to go through and see who you mesh the best with. You know, you may see somebody on 
Facebook or TV or you know anything that you think, oh, I want this one, but then you go in and you fall in love with another one. Yeah. So it happens a lot. All right, thank you so much, yeah. Stephanie. All right, Andrina, let's find you a forever home. And Kara, I know you heard that she's good with cats. I know, so <laughs> I'm keeping my eye out for that. But I will say, Andrina, like she seems very stylish as well. I mean, she has her dress on today. I saw the picture of her with the bumblebee costume on as well. So she is such a good girl. I know she's going to be finding a forever home here soon.